has requested a meeting with you. This should come as to no surprise, seeing as this has been what we've been doing every single day. I presume because you know that, I won't have to pry you off that corner. Haven't you guys had enough of me? Aren't you sick of me yet? If it's any consolation, I was done with you the moment you set foot here. Unfortunately for you, Lord expectations is far to be that of anyone in this facility. No. Ugh, and I thought maybe I would have gotten through to you this time. But as I said, we do this every day, so I should know better. Get this straight. I'm me. And you're also me. That makes you, you me. No, that makes you, you me. That's what I just said! No, you said I was you, but I am me. So that makes you me, that means me is me, and that makes us me. Wait, that makes you wrong, but I'm right, and I'm fixing what you're saying that's right, that's wrong, but I'm right, that means us is me, and me is me. Ah! We have arrived, under unenthusiastic circumstances, nevertheless. Drop the poor child. She is an honored guest, Shade. I had this conversation with you before. I will have no more of you treating her like a savage. Fine. That is unacceptable! You said drop her. Insolent child, you know very well what I meant. You would do well to dismiss yourself. Very well. We meet again, Rebecca. Rebecca, 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 Rebecca. That's not my name! Why do people keep calling me that? Then do tell me, what is your name? I. It's fine. I understand you haven't grown comfortable with the fact that you have a name. If you would be so willing to cooperate, I will give you an explanation as to why that is your name. Lies! This is all a ploy to get me to do whatever you want! You won't tell me what I need to know! You'll only tell me what I want to hear, and that isn't the truth! Have you thought that maybe what you desire to hear is the truth? Stop! I won't let you break me like this! My thoughts are all I have left. You will not get through to them! Mark my words, Rebecca. I dealt with far more challenges than you will ever present to me. I will not give up on you. You will not be here much longer. The voices, they never stop. I am not a part of your imagination. Lies! How do I know this isn't just me, or that man trying to get into my head? You can trust me, child. For you see, I was once captive here as well. If, if that's true, why did you come back? He could have sent you to try and coax me into his grasp, to become nothing but a mindless drone! Please, allow me to help you. I know the way out. Please, allow me to help you. Who are you? That's not important right now. 
What's important is that I get you out of this place and get you help. I hate to see all these poor children suffer when I know I can do something about it now. I have nowhere to go. You don't need a place to go. When you get out, just go straight. Go as far away from here as possible. I know somebody who would be more than willing to accommodate to you should you meet up with them in the future. This was made from a powerful gem. It is rumored to have been made from the remnants of the eighth Chaos Emerald. It is now called the Shattered Crystal. There is no such thing. Take this, and you will see for yourself. It will give you all the strength to get back on your feet and find yourself again. Perhaps you will remember someday. Go, child. Now! Thank you. You've gone far enough. How did you know? <laughs> Silly girl. You ignored this one simple fact when you were escaping. You left your cell door open. Now, I might have been unsuspecting longer if you'd taken the care to close it. Alas, everything happens for a reason. You could call it destiny, really. I've made it this far, and I won't turn back! Not now, and not ever! <laughs> How cute! You actually think you have a chance against me! I will be fair and stand here. Go ahead, strike me, like it will do anything. I'm gonna say this one last time! Leave me alone! I hope you're happy. Rebecca has escaped. I feel as though I should be furious for allowing this to happen. But I can't. She's only a child. And perhaps this is best for her. Her condition is only deteriorating. All motive would be lost and your mission would render meaningless if she weren't in good health. Hmm. You're right. If I press this matter, it will only make the situation worse. I won't pursue her because I am certain she will be back in due time. Strange as it is, I can't see her in my mind anymore. It's as if she's trying to erase any trace of her from my consciousness. I wonder how that possibly could be. Only because I care for you, I will remind you once. Do not interfere with my work. If I suspect you are interfering with missions other than your own, your gift is subject to be forfeit. However, I know we both don't want that. Now do we, Alina? Yes, my lord. Good. I have someone else to attend to now. So many colors. I almost forgot how beautiful this was. <laughs> I will take good care of this. I won't ever forget her. <laughs> <laughs>